Listen, I am at the age where I can go for your husband, your daddy, or your son. Don't play with me, ho. Stay in your lane. Woo-wee. Ladies, y'all need to be aware of these women like this out there running around in society. Could be your best friend, could be your sister, could be your co-worker. There's a lot of home wreckers out here. Now, granted, she's sitting on here with TikTok, so that's probably a filter on her face. She probably got a ton of makeup on. I can't really tell what she looks like with all of, all of that, but I'll say that maybe she is attractive. Now, these women are the worst because these women get a lot of attention and they can easily finesse men into situations by just batting an eye, by just shaking a hip. By just doing a little rub on the arm, things like that. Be careful of these type of women. Fellas, be careful, extra careful of these type of women because these women will get you caught up in bad situations. You want to hear a horror, horror story? I'll give you one. I had a friend years ago that dealt with a woman just like this. She was actually best friends with somebody that he went to school with. And she was flirting with this guy the whole time, right? Little rubs, little this, little that. Eventually, he kind of fell into it, right? Now, what happens next is crazy because this guy decided that one day he was going to go visit his girlfriend. This woman happened to be there. His girlfriend leaves to go to the supermarket. While she's going to the supermarket, the guy falls for this girl's charms, right? Then the woman comes back that he's in a relationship with. She notices something fishy, but she doesn't say anything. A couple months go by. She does the same thing because now she's thinking about it so much and she wants to know if it's true. So the same situation takes place. She goes to the grocery store. She leaves her friend there. They end up doing what they do, have sex, right? She still doesn't say anything. She waits a couple more weeks, and she kind of repeats the same process. She goes to the store again. This time, she goes to the store, but she doesn't actually go to the store. She calls up her homeboys. Her homeboys go knock on the door and say, hey, man, come out. We want you to go do something with us, whatever. This dude is in there with this girl. He opens the door. They bombard, push him inside. They hold this guy hostage for two days. Beat him to a pulp. Guess when the girl left that he was messing around with? The girl that he had sex with that was best friends with his girlfriend. She left within 30 minutes of them people arriving. She was able to leave, but he was stuck in there for 48 hours. They damn near killed him. All because of that. Because that woman that he was in a relationship with, she was a nice person and all of that, but she had a history of, you know, aggression. She had turned her life around. She still had these connections with all of these unsavory type of characters. One happened to be somebody she was very close to. She mentioned the situation. He decides to go on over there on his own with his friends to teach the guy a lesson. Damn near killed the guy. This guy used to work on my car. And I went down to the shopping, uh, to the uh, auto place that he worked at. And I said, where is he? Still not here, not here, not here, not here. Finally, I found him. I called him, talked to his mama, went and saw him. He was still bruised up, beat up, all because of that. So, fellas, the reason why I tell this story is to be careful who you deal with. I don't care how attractive she is. I don't care what she says to you. And ladies, be mindful of women like this. Because something that happens can affect you. Now, as far as the girl that he was in a relationship with, nothing happened to her. He let it slide, but he could have easily came back with retaliation and hurt her. He knew where she lived at, knew where she worked, knew where her parents were, knew where her, her siblings lived and everything else. But he didn't do anything to her, but he easily could have. 
So you can avoid these type of situations by not dealing with women like that. Ladies, be careful who you keep around you. Because a lot of these women that are around you do not care about you. They want what you have and they will do anything to get what you have and they will do anything to ruin what you have. You have the power to achieve anything you want. Don't let anything or anyone distract you from your goals. And remember, stay focused, stay strong, and stay positive. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share this video with those in need.